real beauty uh, of Ayurveda is that it's all about bringing you back to your constitution. So bringing you back to yourself. I feel like there's so many, you know, diets out there. It's all about, you know, giving you the, this sort of a body or that kind of digestion. But there, I don't know of any other that's about bringing you home, bringing you back to yourself. And I feel like just saying that makes me feel so good. My name is Sonia Sheikh, and I'm actually a student studying to become an Ayurvedic doctor. Um, I'm here at One World because I had the good fortune um, of attending the National Ayurvedic Conference in the spring. Uh, One World is one of the sponsors this year, and they raffled off um, a PK, a Panchakarma week, to one conference participant, and that happened to be me. So by the grace of the universe, um, I've been invited back to Bali for this wonderful experience. So I'm here for two weeks, and this is actually my first Panchakarma experience. I feel so grateful to be able to actually experience these things that I've been studying. I always knew that I wanted to have a healing practice that kind of had this trifecta of um, food as medicine, holistic nutrition, and then some kind of body modality, body work, and then also something to support the like psychological support, mental health. And I thought that I would have to go and study those three things independently and then bring them together in my own way until I came across Ayurveda and realized they already do it. So for me, um, I have several goals for my Panchakarma experience. I um, have had a very, a lot of motion in my life since, well, my entire adult life. Um, I'm living already in my 11th country. I came from a career where I was working on health projects and developing countries, which there was a lot of motion in my life. And once you study Ayurveda, you realize how hard that is on parts of the body. So I'm, I'm here to strengthen my digestion, to kind of overcome some fatigue. I had three babies very close together, um, which was very draining on the body. And yeah, so I'm just here to kind of ground myself and strengthen my digestion. Overall, I mean, I feel like the protocol has been very similar to what I expected, but I've been really blown away by the quality of the treatments. I feel like there's One World has this amazing combination of these ancient Ayurvedic treatments performed by the Balinese, which bring this extra touch that I just don't think can be replicated elsewhere. They bring so much love and presence and joy in the treatments that it's really something um, that I hope to bring with me in my practice one day. So now that my two weeks are almost over, I can say that I feel so much more grounded. So there's like this very effortless joy that's kind of overcome me. Um, my body feels much more open just from all the fantastic yoga classes with Mayan and the treatments, of course, as well. And I really can feel what we learn in, in class that panchakarma is a way that, you know, when um, our body becomes out of balance. The doshas, which all live in our digest different parts of the digestive system, start to roam around the body. And I really do have that sensation that the doshas are coming home, which is a you know, big idea about panchakarma. So I um, am going home very content and hope it's not my last time here. I think on my first night here, I arrived and did the evening yoga class. And the first person that I met um, had been here already four times. So you have a lot of returning clients, which I think says a lot about the place. But she asked me my name and she said, is it your first time? I said, yes. She said, well, this is my favorite place in the world. So I can understand there's a lot, there are a lot of guests that say it's their favorite place in the world. And 
it's completely understandable. So I would recommend um, One World Ayurveda to anyone, honestly to anyone with an Ayurvedic background or not. Um, even if you don't have any background in Ayurveda, come and understand what is your constitution and what is your current imbalance and they will they will show you the way and ayurveda is an amazing science because in ayurveda there are six um, stages of pathogenesis of the development of disease and the first three of those are under the radar of western medicine and they also are not that complicated to correct ayurveda has these tools to teach us how to self-heal before our problems become you know, out of control and difficult to heal. So yeah, even if you aren't uh, familiar, come and learn about your constitution and come and learn about how to keep yourself in balance, get the tools so that you don't need to see doctors in the future, or at least fewer.